I am addicted to consuming drugs and sometimes it's hard for me to control my nafs. What can I do to achieve discipline and stop consuming drugs? As far as the ruling on drugs is concerned, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is very clear in Surah Maida, chapter number 5 of Islam 90. Ya ayyu an nasu inna ya lidin amanu inna mal khamru al maysuru. O you believe more certainly in toxic and gambling. Wal anthabu al azlamu, dedication of stone, divination of arrows, rishsim memle shaitan. These are certain handiwork. First the nibul will come to fluid. Abstain from the handiwork that you may prosper. Here Allah is saying that Ya ayyu alladhina amun, O you believe, inna mal khamru al maysuru, more certainly intoxicants and gambling. Here intoxicants means, doesn't only mean alcohol. It means all sorts of intoxicants including drugs. So anything which intoxicates you, which makes you lose your senses, whether it be alcohol, whether it be whiskey, whether it be drugs, a haram. So this verse prohibits a person from having drugs. The question posed is, that I am a drug addict and how can he prevent himself from stopping this addiction? Number one is that you see to it that you read the Quran. You read the Quran along with understanding. Read the translation of the Quran in the language you understand the best. The Quran is a healing for mankind. The Quran says in Surah Isra chapter number 17 verse number 81, that in the Quran there is healing for mankind. So number one would be that you read the Quran along with Arabic, even the translation, and many a times it will open up your doors. At the same time, the Quran says in Surah Nahal chapter 16, verse 43, and Surah Ambiya chapter number 21, verse number 7. First aluk ahli zikri in kundum la If you don't know, ask the person who's knowledgeable. So what you have to do is you have to go to an expert go to a medical doctor who is expert in de-addiction. So there are people, there are specialists who are expert in de-addiction. So when you go to the specialist, they will tell you, they will guide you how to try and de-addict yourself from the drug that you are addicted to. Based on the drug you are taking, maybe they will give you an alternate dose, they may give you an injection which will prevent you from, depending upon which drug it is. So you haven't mentioned which drug it is, so based on that, if you go to a specialist, the specialist will give you a special diet, will tell you what to do, what not to do, and will show you things, how can you relieve yourself from this addiction. But as I said, number one is the Quran, see to it that you offer salah, but naturally when you are intoxicated, you can't offer salah. You should not read the Quran. So when you are sober, when you are sober, when the effect of intoxication is not there, then see to it that you read the Quran, you offer the salah and you ask Allah for help. The best person to solve your problem is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And when you ask Allah to help you, see to it that you pray to him in your sujood, in your tahajjud. You pray your tahajjud in the last one third of night. In your sujood you ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to relieve you from this addiction. And inshallah Allah will help you. I, while you are doing this, while you are praying, while you are reading the Quran, while you are offering salah, while you are seeking Allah's help, at the same time, even go to a specialist, he will tell you ways how to rid yourself from this drug. And inshallah, I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, may you get de-addicted and see to it that you, Allah stops you from this addiction which is haram.